Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Rosie Level 50. This is part 27, and today I'm going to be playing as the Vanguard, as always. <laughs> the map is Rome, and the game type is Wanted. So I'm going to be using my disguise and bodyguard this time. I'm not sure why I used Templar Vision last time, maybe I clicked on the wrong profile set. No idea. But oh well. Yeah, my voice sound, might sound a bit weird again because I'm recording this at um, half one in the morning again. So I can get this out for you guys overnight. Because I do try my best to get videos out. I do upload um, regularly as well if you're new to the channel. So um, if you're looking for someone like me and you were looking for regular content, yeah, it's good to subscribe to me. And I got a really cool aerial kill back there. I was pretty chuffed for that. She, she was looking for a, um, her target, but she wasn't looking out for me, which she should have been doing. And there is my renegade. Um, him climbing and running a lot caused him to have a red arrow appear on his head. And that's how I knew he was my pursuer. So I'm just waiting for him to come around that corner now. Or is he above me? I'm not quite sure. Where is he? Here he is. There he is. There he is. No, that's not him. There he is. He must have killed another vanguard because he got lured, so um It don't matter, I'm dead anyway. <laughs> yeah, always the case you think you've done really awesome because you got a lure or a stun, but then you just go get killed. It's oh my God. It's crazy. Because I think what happens is um when you, when you stun someone or you um your pursuer like um, kills a NPC. I think you become like off guard sort of thing. Um, so you don't really expect to like, kill you, but you should never take your guard off. And when I was in that hay bale back then, um, I was trying to go for a hidden um, kill bonus, but I, I kind of like went got out of the haystack. And I got a really nice naked stun there, didn't I? And this bitch just won't die. <gasps> oh yeah, I'm level 19. Whoop, whoop. But it's so funny. <laughs> I'm like level 30 something. <laughs> but obviously, I haven't, I haven't seen it before. I haven't been playing any multiplayer. Because I'm waiting for the DLC. But I'm not going to mention that. Because I've said that several times now. I'm probably boring you guys to death with that little speech or thing. But oh well. The DLC, DLC is coming out so soon. I'm really excited. I'm really hoping that it's free though. I don't really want to be paying for it this side of Christmas. Because, um, I have money, but the money's for Christmas presents. Like, my parents. I need to buy, um, Christmas. I need to get buy a Christmas present for my parents. Um, I've already got my dad some stuff, but I need to get my mum some stuff. So, um,. Fingers crossed it is free, but um, all the DLCs which are in Brotherhood for multiplayer are free. Um, I'm not sure if the Da Vinci story mode one was free, I'm not sure. But, like, I don't know why I stunned that guy there, because there was clearly not a circle above his head. But oh well, sorry I just hit my mic. Yeah, I'm not sure if the Da Vinci one was free or not. But I know the multiplayer ones, the Animus Project DLCs are free, which were the map hacks and um, what do you call them, characters. That sounds a little just like barge me, I'm like, thanks. <laughs> oh well. And that guy, unfortunately, triggered a chase, which caused me to run for a chase breaker and got me greater variety from an escape. I'm not complaining at all. That was awesome. But I was complaining about that. I just got stabbed through the shoulder. That was not good. But that was only for 150 points. I really don't understand people who do kills for like really shitty points. It's like, why do you even bother? Like, you can get stunned for that. You get more on a stun. That bloody woman's glowing like a bloody Christmas tree. Obviously, she's using Templar vision. Um, it's, I'm quite like, confused why she didn't see me. Uh, maybe she was too busy looking for her target. But, as I said before, you have to look out for your pussy as well. Sorry guys, I just yawned. 
That was my first yawn of the night, actually. And I will be going to bed in a minute anyway. Because I want to get up early in the morning. Because I want to do some things. Um, I need to do some revision as well. Because, as always, I haven't done any revision yet. And that guy... Where is he going? That com I remember this match. And that completely confused me. I have no idea where he got. He was just like running straight past me. I don't know if he was running from his pursuers or something. He might have been. Um, but oh my god. I was just like, what? What is he doing? He's renegades. He just looks sweet. Make sure he's dead. Which obviously not, because he's going to respawn in a minute. But it will. Oh shit, here comes someone else. And unfortunately I can't get away. I only like that um, the, the death scene where they jump on your back when you're still running. But it's really, really cool how um how there's like slow motion in a in a multiplayer game. Um, because surely if you all see multiplayer, the other players who witness the kill We'll be seeing it like normal motion. And um, I don't know, it's really weird. You don't really often get slow motion in multiplayer. And I like it because it looks cool, but I don't like it as well because it wastes time. If you get, if you die and um, slow motion appears, um, it wastes an extra few seconds than it would when it's normally. So it's, I don't know. Actually, does it waste seconds? It feels like it wastes seconds. Let's just put it, leave it as that. It does feel like it wastes time. Um, so that's why I don't like it. But I like it because it does look cool. It makes you kind of smile when you die. <laughs> yeah, I've got really nothing to say. I need to tie up my bedroom now. My bedroom is like bloody pixel. It's like my GameCube wires everywhere. Yeah, I've been playing some Resident Evil 4 with um, that epic child. Uh, but it didn't crash or anything. I have, I really don't know what's going on with the GameCube and um, Remake. As you know, I haven't posted Remake in ages, but... Um, so I just yawned again, and of course that bitch poisoned me. It's not going to be that easy, is it? But after Tomb Raider, hopefully I'll be able to get Remake done. Um, if it's still... After Remake, sorry, if after Remake, I will test recording another game on the GameCube. Probably just record Room Evil 4 while I'm just playing it. Um, <coughs> pardon me, sorry. Um, I'll just test it, and if it does cut out, I will not be doing the Room Evil franchise. Um, I may do I think I'm a fire of that epic child. Depends if he can like if the commentary is good enough. Because I know sometimes when we're talking on Skype, his um his audio is not very good. Sometimes you can't hear him properly. Um, but hopefully um, it will be alright because the majority of the time you can hear him. Um, his mic's just a little bit weird though. But it's okay. It's good. Um, yeah, so I might do a co-op with him, because I know that he wants to play some mercenaries with me when he gets his PS3 for Christmas, because he has his um, PS3 games, but um, he doesn't have a PS3, because he used to have PS3, but I think it broke or something. Um, so we'll probably record mercenaries, and I'll put that up on YouTube. That'll be awesome. I don't know if we'll do a lot. I don't know if we'll do a dual commentary or something. Um, but I don't know. I might just record it. <sighs> and, um, I'll probably have. A, um, sorry, I'll probably add a commentary to it if we don't do live. Oh, my bits died. Never mind. Yeah, it'll be, it'll be good for Christmas. I'm really excited for Christmas. Um, I'm normally not excited for Christmas, but I know that I'm getting some really awesome games, and I know that Epic Charles getting the PS3, so I'm really excited just to play with him actually for Christmas. It'll be so awesome. I'm also looking forward to um, diving into Dead Rising 2 um, off the record because that's um, in the same time as Dead Rising 2. Um, 
It's a little um, theme park that says coming soon. That's where Dave Rosen two off the record is. Um, so yeah, that'll be cool. Um, I don't know who else is getting it, but if one of my subscribers is getting it, I'll happily um, play with you guys. Seriously, I don't know if I'll record it though. Um, but yeah, I finished first this map. Got a um, oh, that's a shame. I got nine kills but ten deaths. But oh well, I finished first. So if you guys want to leave a comment, a like, and even subscribe, I'll be very grateful. Remember, I do upload regularly, so um, keep checking back to the channel. But it'll be much easier if you just subscribe, because it'll appear in your sub box. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.